light just fire behind us. Because of the altitude of the Hubble Space Telescope, we got to go into a relatively high, uh, insert into a high orbit. Uh, what we found almost immediately is this orbit uh, allowed us uh, um, a greater views uh, than we had seen before on any of our flights. This was what Houston looked like at night. We never saw the U.S. Uh, in the daytime. We saw it at night. And at the far top left is Chicago. Our center screen is Atlanta. Uh, as we come across here, uh, you can see the lights of Florida and then on up the east coast. In the other direction floated the reason for this mission, the Hubble Space Telescope. The closer we got, the more excited I got. <clears throat> I was pretty impressed when I got my first view out the window, and that's just what it looked like. And uh, this is the final approach to the telescope. Uh, uh, Kavi was uh, flying the orbiter uh, in a very professional way <coughs> and uh, stabilized the orbiter versus the telescope in uh, such a position that I could... Uh, the EVA shots are actually speeded up two or even four times because uh, things move pretty slowly. Uh, this gives you the basic idea of how we work. One person... On Happy rolled up to bring back to Earth. So Kathy Thornton had to release it in space. It looked like a giant bird, giant soaring bird over the desert. It was just the most incredible sight. I was mesmerized for a period of time just watching it. And there's not much more you can say about it. It's just fabulous. You see the Red Sea and the Gulf of Aden, and it was it was one spectacular. Many weeks to wait to see that Hubble really did work. After Cloud released the telescope, uh, I fired a few pulses to get us back and away and the telescope slowly started drifting. And here's the west coast of the U.S. as we complete our trip around the world. You can see San Francisco Bay up in the center, Los Angeles down at the bottom, uh, Las Vegas coming into view. Las Vegas is outrageously bright. <laughs> uh, you could see the strip from 350 miles. This is Houston. Take a look in the upper left corner and you'll see a very bright fireball meteor come through the atmosphere. Uh, there, you, there it is. Uh, and you can also see Dallas and San Antonio there. And then it, that was looking from the east, so we continue to go. This is looking up the east coast. You can see lightning storms. You can see a little bit of aurora up there, looking back towards the west now over Florida. This is